Shall we begin? Why would a good God allow suffering to exist? Suffering to exist. Does God really exist? Really exist? Let's begin now. Why did God command the deaths of so many people in the Bible? People in the Bible. Why does God remain so hidden? Remain so hidden. Welcome to the third degree. My name is Sule Prince and I'm here with Dr. Tony Costa. Now, Dr. Costa, around the Christmas season there is a lot of controversy within the churches. Some believe you should celebrate it, some believe that you should not. Where does the word Christmas come from and what does it mean? Well, the word uh, Christmas comes from two words really, Christ and Mass. And it had to do with the celebration of the birth of Christ and the word Mass is a word that comes from the Latin Misa, and in the Latin church, in the Western church, whenever a service would be concluded, the pastor or the minister would say, Ita Misa Est, meaning that the service is all over, you are dismissed. And so the word uh, Mass has to do with the sending out, the conclusion of a service and sending the people out from the congregation. And therefore, the word Christmas has to do with the celebration of Christ's birth. And it was associated with that particular service of the Nativity. So it has nothing to do with the Roman Catholic Church, is Mass? No, it has nothing to do with the Roman Catholic Church. Uh, the word Mass, of course, in the Roman Catholic Church is usually associated with the Eucharist or the offering up of the Communion service. But the word Mass is also used by the Orthodox Church. It's also used by Lutherans. And again, it fundamentally has to do with the dismissal of the service. And so it became a a small word, if you will, a Latin word for the Christian service. Thank you for watching this video. If you like what you see, please press the subscribe button right below. And beside that is the bell icon. If you want to receive all of our notifications of everything that we do, press that icon as well. Thank you.